posture. <laughs> Yo, his arms are out too. Though? Yeah. Hold up. This man's gonna have no neck cramps. Yo, I wonder how we sleep then. I'll ask him later. All right, but we're gonna hop into game one right now. Uh, Kenta Theta already That's keeping up the lemons. Ooh, really got Trump already. That's absolutely forward of you to ask somebody how you sleep at night, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, maybe he's nice. He'll let me know. But <laughs> Alright, Bandit starting to throw out these Lloyd Rockets. Oh, and Nair actually goes through Lemons! Oh, that's going to be big. Alright, man. The guns are out. We have an absolute sniper duel in the building. Oh, the damage from Bandit right now. And the turnups. And the bowling balls. They keep oh, coming. Oh, we get this jump! Yeah, oh. That's really great awareness right there. That is from actually known as being the Cotangent Theta special. He never uses his jump off stage until last minute. You see right there, he goes for the up B recovery. Okay. He never used his jump in that. It's because Mega Man has one of those up B recoveries where you can jump immediately after. He catches a lot of people off guard. But because it is the Cotangent Theta special, it's actually very punishable when you see it happen. Uh, if you I mean, know, most people are going to know if Tangent Theta is yeah. going to be doing it. Thanks for telling everyone. Yeah. But hopefully he checks out this VOD, you know, get yourself You don't, you don't tell me secrets, all right? I, I tell everybody. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Bandit off stage yet again. Great attempt right there from Tangent Theta, but unfortunately not getting it. But he does get that back air. Oh, and again. Yo. Sealing the stock early, 95% only on that. Yeah, that was that homie DI, real talk. Oh, and the tornadoes are out. Oh, but Bandit has one now. Yeah, that was a really good pressure right there. Coming off of the pocket. What? <laughs> Go Tangent having no fear. Air dodging him. He's at like 138. Still throwing out all these hit bosses. Yeah, the pellets are out. Now the tree's out, and the axe murder is coming through. But Bandit not able to seal the stock out still. Yeah, he's having a lot of trouble trying to get in and close out this stock. Uh, content is doing very, very well to get out of the way. But he just ducked right under that Lloyd Rocky. You see that? Yeah, he's not having none of it. All right, Bandit has the axe again. Looks like he's just trying to get the stock with that. Maybe a read option, but has him on stage with. And just one turn up, I bet he wishes JP was controlling the villager. JP would have gotten three. I'm just saying, Definitely. Man. JP being another one of our premier villager players out here in NorCal. Yeah, he's actually here today, too, so looking forward Is to him a little later. Yeah, by Rockets. Interesting. Going for the forward throw, getting stage position. Z drop? No. Not yet. No, I think just because Bandit had a metal blade of his own, he wasn't trying to get in there. The, the, his stock was almost evaporated. Oh, and the slide with the metal blade. Try to catch him off guard. Yeah, no, that's also a good tangent data special. Coming in with all these glide tosses a lot of times. He's not even trying to get close to the tree. Oh, no, not at all. This is smart stuff coming from Cotangent Theta. You're just keeping that middle ground where he has the perfect spacing and get these lemons, force pressure on Bandit, and force him to make a move and just reacting to it, basically. Yeah, all Bandit's doing right now is throwing out these Lord Rockets, trying to get in there to send him off, but I love it. He's trying to get a couple more mix up options. He's trying to go for a couple pivot grabs. Ooh! In full rage, Mega Man, I think up throw will kill. Oh. I guess not. Battlefield being a very large player. Yep. Cotangent Theta, and he, this man kept his posture straight the whole entire game. What a legend. He was ready. The Wiimote oh, spe master speaking himself. Speaking of JP. Speaking of JP. The villager brethren helping yeah. each other out. They, they even, like, wear the same clothes. <laughs> share the like, same style. Give the hat that JP's wearing to Bandit, and you can't even tell the difference. No, not at all, man. But yo, can we talk about Cotangent Theta? Doing Dude. like his posture is so good, it helped him out so much in the game. By the way, can we talk about uh they JP and Bandit teamed together as a villager duel uh team last week. And uh they wore literally the exact same outfit. They both look like where's Waldo? Yeah. <laughs> Stripe beanie, yeah, striped that, shirt. That, that, I mean that definitely just sounds like them. I'm not even surprised. Re really good friends. But, you know, Bandit coming out with the Mario Switch. So I played as Mario, actually, oh, when I last played in a tournament like a month ago. 
pretty solid Mario overall. But I mean, yeah. There, well, there was a time that Bandit really wasn't going to get Lizard, and so he tried to go ahead and you know main Mario for a while. And you know, it's putting a good amount of work. Uh, I'm glad it's still seeing it out. Putting, it's doing a lot better than this villager so far, though. But man, what are these reads? I see this random down smash. Alright, another Nair. Oh, and just going for the raw <laughs> Shoryuken right there. Yeah, no. Uh, Katheta right there was expecting Ben to come in and try to punish him for being so aggressive. But hey, Ben is doing this very smartly, just trying to get some guaranteed damage, and the up air is coming out. Alright, more pressure with the back airs. Has him back off stage. Holding that forward here. Charge up smash right there, man. You ain't fooling me. I know you're a Mario. I know what you're going to do, says Cotangent Theta. Surprise Bandit's not just running and try to catch these landings on these uh, these jump nares coming out. Yeah, no. Well, at the same time, uh, Bandit's not really not in a good position to go ahead and do so. Uh, he might just end up getting hit at the end. Just because, you know, uh, with the lemons, they have the hitbox of the actual lemon. Then the very tip of really the blaster, is, like, it has a lot more luck. Ever. Like I was saying, it's just you gotta wait till he gets like a full hop going on, right? And then you could just kind of sneak in underneath. That's how I always saw uh, Ally taking off stocks off of Kameme actually at Evo. I'm pretty sure most of the stocks are taken off by just waiting for him to make a, a jump somewhere in there with the neutral airs, and then uh, come in and underneath and just give him the head, man. <laughs> yeah, no, don't don't read into one. that too deep. <laughs> All right, damage coming out. These choice of words. <laughs> All right, but you know who else is going in right now? Bandit, a lot of percent being rocked on. Just some jabs and just, you know, simple little normals coming out. And I do love them, like, the more basic, simple plays. You saw that, you know, trying to be a little too fancy with Villager wasn't working. Uh, now you just, you know, throw out some aerials, throw out some tilts. You're going to get yourself some stocks, possibly. Yeah, this is all fundamentals coming from Bandit right now. I mean, he doesn't have too many hours in the lab with Mario overall, so you won't see all of the crazy custom combos that you might be accustomed to seeing top Marios do. However, this man is playing the most fundamental game he possibly can play right now, and Mario's a great character for that, man. Uh, the only thing that Panda has to go ahead and, you know, fix up is the, whole, the use of Nair. He's throwing out a little bit too much. Back and coming out offstage situation. So these two are pretty much at death percent. This is the Randy Ford smash, though. You do not want to get that cape base oh, right back no. at you. I thought he jumped for a second. He did <laughs> jump, and he actually wow. jumped out of the corner of it. He managed to get out of there just in time. I know some very fortunate stuff from Bandit there. Definitely a bold move, man. Yeah, but you know, that up air is something you do not want to jump. And he's standing really close to the ledge against Mega Man. Mega Man has a great back throw himself. Yep. No, Tangent Theta could try to come in with that glide toss. Oh, try to get the back one throw. back throw for himself, but he is going to get back throw. But holding on to the stock. It's underrated just how heavy Mega Man is. No! <laughs> oh my goodness. Was that <gasps> the crash, crash bomber? Crash bomb the on crash the stage? Bomber. There's no way that was intentional, but hey, we take those, Mio. No, we calculated. definitely take those. Come on, that was calculated. Good stuff coming from Cotangent Theta. Didn't break a sweat, didn't break a He must posture. be so happy right now. Oh, yeah. He's feeling good.